Hi, this is Tracy H. Dane. I want to thank you for joining me for our October 2018 tarot reading, and this will be for the sign of Scorpio. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers for the highest good of all. At the beginning of the month, I'll take a card from the top. Middle of the month, I'm going to take a card from the center. And the end of the month, I'm going to take a card from the bottom. Okay, very interesting month for you. We start out with the full. So there's going to be some type of opportunity, okay, in the beginning of the month. And you're going to need to take a leap of faith. You might not have all the answers as to how this is going to happen, how you're going to do it. Just trust that whatever it is, it's a wonderful opportunity that's going to present itself out of nowhere. You're not going to see it coming, but this card is telling you to go for it. It's possibly the beginning of a new adventure, a new way of life for you. Um, and you should welcome this, okay? It's a positive thing. However, in the middle of the month, we have the Four of Pentacles. So this has you wondering, you know, maybe how you're going to finance this, how you're going to pay for this. If, if you make these changes, will you have maybe enough money to live on? This woman is grasping onto these pentacles for dear life, okay? She's wanting to be financially secure, okay? And we all do. However, sometimes when we have an opportunity to present ourselves and we hold back because we're fearful like this woman here that you know they might not have enough money okay don't allow yourself to be gripped like this okay this is the card of like a miser who's just focusing too much on the money hoarding too much of the money away and not allowing themselves to expand okay this is an opportunity for something new to enter However, you're having maybe some doubts financially as to how you're going to make this work, okay? But there's no need to worry about it because by the end of the month, we have temperance here. And it's a, a beautiful card with these angel wings. And with this temperance card, the energy that's coming up at the end of the month, what I'm feeling is there's going to be a need for some type of moderation or balance, okay? Like I said, here, you're going to have to loosen your grip. Okay, maybe you're out of balance. Maybe we're putting too much importance on, you know, finances and money. And maybe that's holding you back from fully embracing whatever this opportunity is here. But this is telling you that, you know, you need to look at your life and see what's out of balance. Is it your emotions that are out of balance? Okay, um, you want to make sure that whatever it is, it is balanced because when we have things that are out of balance in our life, sooner or later they manifest into other problems. So take a look at what's going on in your life at the end of the month or what's been going on that needs to be balanced out, okay? And whatever needs to be in moderation because we all overindulge. And as we know, overindulgence causes problems. We eat too much. We put on weight. We shop too much. We get into debt. So whatever needs to be balanced out, you want to make sure you do that by the end of the month. Exciting month for you. If you've enjoyed this reading, please subscribe to my channel because I will be back.